Okay, so Zoe Lavarn is a 19-year-old TikToker. And like most TikTokers, she doesn't have any talent, skill. She's just attractive. And she also kissed a 13-year-old boy. So a while back, Zoe's ex-boyfriend and her ex-friend DMs got leaked. And in the DMs, the friend said how she stopped talking to her because of how weird she was and acting with this 13-year-old kid. Not too long after, the video of Zoe and Connor kissing got leaked, and after the backlash, Zoe's mom made this video. Anybody can reach over and kiss somebody. He, they're best friends, and this needs to stop you guys. Why are you doing this? It doesn't matter if they're best friends or strangers. You shouldn't be kissing 13-year-old boys. The only time it's okay to be kissing 13-year-old boys is if you're a 14-year-old. Also, Zoe's mom, clearly a MILF. Anyway, a bit after that video, Zoe does a Instagram live story talking about everything. Now let's roll through that tape and kind of discuss it. Like A lot of people are making this out to be something that it's not and making it to be worse than it seems. It is what it seems. You're 19 years old kissing a 13 year old and it's pretty disgusting that i didn't groom connor not like wouldn't do that to him literally love connor to death they wouldn't do anything to connor ever without consent connor and i both consented to kissing it doesn't matter if there was consent it's still creepy you're still a pedophile also consent doesn't make it okay there are still legal age limits that was how it went we both liked each other and then we realized that the ages were too different so you realize the age difference after the kiss. What, did him riding a bike and playing Fortnite not sound any alarms off? Also, you're saying you have feelings for a 13 year old. Yeah, that's what the definition of pedophilia is. Because people like to put their little noses into other people's business, it makes it worse than it needs to be. People are sticking their nose into this because it's gross and fucked up and we all kind of need, need to let other people know what's going on. I didn't groom Connor, wouldn't do that. He's a kid and I'm aware of that. And it just happened we both were in a dark place when we first like became friends and we both just ended up catching feelings for each other. And friends do that, they catch feelings for each other. That's not a bad thing. Okay, now if I'm not wrong, Mini Lad used mental health as a way of being creepy with his fans. And guess what? Mental health is an excuse to be a pedophile. And Zoe. It is a bad thing if your friend is underage. Also, why are you friends with a 13-year-old? Yes, the, the age is a bad thing. Yes, it's wrong. Yes, it's not good. And we both realized that, and we stopped. Sure, okay, fair enough. But again, you got feelings for a 13-year-old, and you act like that's okay. And what's worse is you acted on it by kissing him. Now, I know there's going to be people out there who are going to think that this is okay because it's an older female kissing a younger boy. And no, pedophilia is still pedophilia. It's not okay if you're a 19-year-old boy kissing a 13-year-old girl, and it's not okay the other way around. <clears throat> anyway, that's my thoughts and shit. Comment, what do you think? You know, sub if you haven't already. Hit that like button. Um, peace. You would, you would dummy, ain't yeah, it funny? I've been the one that came from nothing, like a drug, I'm up and coming. I'm gonna blow up in your face. You would dummy, ain't yeah, it funny? I've been the one that came from nothing, like a drug, I'm up and coming. I'm gonna blow up in your face. Uh, hey, feeling like a G on my high horse, we be stomping. I'm off to blow, I sell a G. You be selling, I'm just living, trying to get myself the shit that I deserve. Put in work, sick of being broke, it's worse.